Every year, thousands of wild birds and fishing fanatics alike flock to the famous Skyward Bridge in St. Petersburg, Florida. However, because humans and nature don't always peacefully coexist, the birds often get injured. Given handouts by passerby and hooked by flailing fish lines, the wild seabirds are sometimes seriously injured and sometimes left for dead. I'm trying to rescue as many of the uh, pelicans that I can that are tangled in uh, fishing line hooks, lures, things like that, and uh, the ones that are uh, very badly damaged, uh, I take them onto the hospital. The ones that are still have good weight and are not badly injured, I uh, take all the hooks and line off of them and then release them. A lot of it is a lot of people uh, not tending their lines and uh, the birds will fly into their lines. They can't see fishing lines so they fly into the lines and then when the line starts coming out of the water the hook goes right into their wings, their breast, their legs. Uh, they get hooked in their mouth. A lot of people will uh, put a uh, fish on a, uh, on a hook and use it for bait and drop it right in front of a pelican and a pelican will swallow it thinking that it's food. One's going to take some real surgery. It's a wow. really bad injury. Yeah, look at the way he's... Uh... Yeah, and look at the way it's in hard. They're going to have to surgically remove it. So I'm not going to, I'm not going to move that. I'm just going to free up any fishing line I can. And it is because of this that St. Petersburg houses the largest wild bird hospital in Northern America, the Sun Coast Seabird Sanctuary. A lot of times you'll feed the hook. You try to do it so that you feed it so that the barb punctures through the skin and then you can clip the barb off and then you feed it out, then you pull it out. So you're trying to push it through the skin to expose the barb, clip the barb, and then pull the hook out. A grassroots organization, the volunteers at the San Coast Seabed Sanctuary save hundreds of wild birds each year by rescuing, rehabilitating and eventually releasing them back to the wild.